happy Wednesday. I'm so sorry for the time change on today's presentation. It's like how I'm swinging at the picture here. The hairdresser called, uh, or the hair salon called, and when my son was going to get his hair cut, they had to reschedule because she was sick. So they've got us with another stylist, but it means we have to go later. Anyway, it was one of those days. So I'm going to jump on and I'm going to do, oh, look at you can see Sean in the background. That's Sean. <laughs> Um, I'm going to jump on and get my Facebook Live done, and then I'll head out for the haircuts. So we're going to sneak over. Ta -ta. Now, as I mentioned, you're going to see me doing a lot of catalog casing over the next little while. Hi, loves! Um, purely because I've got some amazing things happening in my Stampin' Up! business, but it means that things are a little bit more hectic and not a lot of time to create more just for a sharing. I've got a lot of events that I've been creating for. So, guess what we're playing with? Whiskey business. Does anyone else feel the need to slide across the floor in socks? I do. Um, hi, you guys. I know, he was so cute. Do you like how awkward he was there, Joe? He was like, how fast can I get in and out of this shot? Um, I didn't warn him that I was going to be live when he walked up the stairs. He just was carrying in my Stampin' Up! Pod, so, oh good, there's more than one. Even better. Okay. So, we're going to get this done so that I am ready to drive, because i got to still drive a half hour to the hair place for them. So, I've got a white sanding block. I have not used this set yet. I'm a little bit giddy about it. We are going to go, and we're going to play with the colors a bit, because I'm not doing it exactly the way it showed it in the catalog. Oh my god, I don't mind early after my adventure getting food just now. What happened? Tell us. Give me the dirt. I need to know about your adventure today. I had no adventures today. Today was a relatively quiet day. I was working on stuff for product shares. I was uh, sending out, you know, packages for other things that I've got on. I'm, notice I'm just stamping these, so I've got my bottle. And I've got, I'm going to do two of these glasses. Which, by the way, I have crystal glasses like this. I don't know why. I feel like I think I needed them when I... I was going to say when I got married. It was when we got married as our uh, one of our wedding gifts I registered for them. Because, you know, you never know when I'm going to need a good old fashion. Okay. Yay! So what we're going to do here, I'm going to stamp this one, sending you an old-fashioned birthday card. I knew that that's what it was called. I knew it was called an old-fashioned. Now, I feel like this might need re King, but in fear of a repeat of how I did the other day and re King black stays on with brown stays on. Here, we're just giving this one a good swoosh. Doot, doot, doot. I feel like I might need to order more of ink. Mine feels like it's getting low. Just got the stamps. Okay, well, we're casing. Don't, Janice, I'm sorry. I wish I was doing something crazy and exciting and doing something of my own, but there is not enough hours right now in the day, so I am going to just sneak on and do a catalog case. And I always find a catalog case is a great way to start. Hi, guys. Okay, see, it's not dark enough. Grr, that's okay, I can make it work. Because right here, I have handy dandy. My boop, 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 basic black marker. So I'm just gonna go in. So ideally, I should have stamped with my Stamparabbas. I never worry when I'm stamping on Whisper White. Whisper White absorbs ink so much quicker. Colored cardstock tends to take a little more patience. And as you can see, not necessarily something I had today, but then you kind of laugh because you don't have patience and then you create work for yourself. So there, we just made it prettier again. We had to eat out because our house is showing over fast food. Half an hour, yeah, super fast, right? Oh my gosh, are you kidding? Uh, more of a red cup. It could be. You never know. Solo cup kind of day. Okay, so we're going to jump off there. Now, I need to make this look like the colors in the catalog. And now my husband is blending things. I'm sorry. He's in the basement. He's doing pasta and prawns for supper. Now, I learned a trick today because I was like, what do you mean they use the everyday label punch to get corner rounder corners? But I'm going to show you. So, Take your paper, go in not from the inside of the punch, come in from the back side. Tuck it in so that it's up against the side and the base. And ta-da, corner rounder. Who knew? You guys all probably did. I'm probably the only person who did not know that. Anyway, super giddy. Check it 
out, okay? So we've got some super cute corner rounded paper. We're going to take our whiskey bottle and then I think I'm gonna use, I'm gonna go with a little bit of, um, what is this called? Mango. We're mangoing people. And then I'm gonna use my pool party. Ooh, maybe not my dark, maybe I'll go lighter. We'll, tr we'll try both. Okay. Oh my God, I'm sorry, I totally, I'll look up and I'm like, what, I'm not following. But it's okay, I don't need to follow. You're, uh, you're talking to each other, I'm all good. I was like, did I miss something that I'm supposed to pay attention to? Okay, so we're gonna add, just I'm using a little bit of pool party in there. And then they've kind of used it, basically, you know how I call it my shading for dummies, which I love, shade away for me. Um, add in a little bit of shading kind of in your glass. There. And then we'll do the same thing over here. And then I'm gonna hit up the top of my ice cube, love it. And then it looks like what they wanted us to, to kind of see here was, you know how you get the shine off the, the uh, top of the bottle. So we're just adding in a little bit of glass shine. Do, 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 do. There, do it there. And then, you know, cause the bottle has some stuff out of it. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, there we go. Sunny Saskatchewan. Good Lord. What's a game changer? What trick did I give you? Oh no, I don't know what I just told you. Did I teach you a trick? I feel like I have ink on my hands because I'm seeing, oh, it's from my pointer finger there. I'm seeing little spots of it there. Okay, so now let's jump back in. Let's melon mambo this up, people. Not melon mambo, mango. I do that every time I say this. I always want to call it melon mambo. I don't know, I feel like we just need to be dancing. Okay, so let's get in here and we're just gonna give this some kind of darker spots in the containers. Doot, 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 doot. And then a little bit going down here. There we go, we're just kind of shaking it up. <laughs> Whiskey, oh my God, I love you guys. You're so cute. Chris, you crack me up. You know, it's super funny. I really wish I drank. <laughs> I don't drink, I never started. It was just kind of one of those things I seem to have missed the boat on. And by the time I decided I would really like to have a drink, I was like, oh, it doesn't taste very good. And I didn't like it. So yeah, I totally missed the boat on that. Now we are gonna jump back in. I want a little bit of more pool party. <laughs> okay. And we're gonna jump in now. And we have got this one. This is my light mango. Oh, it is so light it's dead. Really? When did I kill it? I had no idea I'd killed this one. There we go. We'll use the back end for today. I guess what I have to add to my list. And if only I'd realized that a couple weeks earlier. Okay. Doot, doot, doot. So we're given. Is that what this is? Is this whiskey? Is that whiskey that's this color? I don't know. I'm like, it's alcohol. That's what it is. That's what we're going with, people. It's Boozy McBoozerson. Homeschooling equals day drinking. <laughs> oh my God, I love you. What about teaching? What is date? What is being a teacher equal? I got 30 of them all day long. Not right now, though. It's summer. I'm not complaining. I am like loving, I'm in summer holiday mode. Okay, now this is the part I don't like. I don't like coloring with this end. I am a paintbrush end girl. Okay, I'm just trying to work the lines together. Work it. Own it. Oh, it's squeaky. This one is like, this one is almost dead. But we're going to make it work. When all else fails, use your back end. Yeah, man. Cinnamon cider. Can you put... Oh. Is that, is that what whiskey is? Is it dark? I don't know. I was just casing the picture in the catalog. And it says they used bumblebee, but they were using bumblebee ink with... Um, what's it called? With a paintbrush. And I'm not doing that today because... You've all witnessed me and a paintbrush and trying to do something live, and we know it didn't really work. 
Okay. Now, any coloring in there? I'm going to grab a little bit of this chocolate. Most teachers I know drink some days. <laughs> I survive on chocolate. Yeah, I'm a chocolate girl. That's my, there's my weakness right there. Okay. Oh, I like that. That kind of pulled it all in a little bit more there. There. So it's kind of the nice part of blends is you don't really have to stress that you're not using exact colors. You can just work it in, work it, hone it. Okay, and then I'm gonna take that light and let it go over the inner part of the ice cubes that are in the glass. Go, ooh, looking, yeah, we got some boozy boozers thing going here. It was super entertaining though. Yep, like browns and reddish, clearly not drinkers. Oh, I love you. Well, we know that though, don't we? <laughs> don't we, Christine? Okay, don't make me giggle because I'll start coughing. Okay, so we've got this. We've got our colored piece here that I did some stuff on. Keep an eye on the time. What time is it? 4.12. Whew. Oh, Case, you would love Christine. You would totally get along with her. I feel like I have to do like a meeting of people. I could do like, what's it called? Like online dating for crafters. Not so that you actually have to date people. I know you all have your other persons. But I just like, I'm like, oh, I know someone you would so get along with. She, you know, she lives in the opposite end of Canada or she lives in the States. Um... And yes, I should just do that. I can match you up with your crafting partners. Because I think that would crack me up. Sorry, I'm sticking my tongue out. Now, I would tell my boys to be quiet. Because they are gaming. Um, in fact, they're gaming together. And so we're just going to let it go. Okay? This is a rare occurrence. Kind of like a sighting of a Sasquatch. Where they're actually interacting with each other. We've hit that lovely age. There we go. <clears throat> Maybe you'll get the full fandangle. You had Sean bringing it boxes, and then we had Sean, you know, blending things for... Actually, we're having booze in our supper. Does that count? Fur Baby is doing well. He, he's having... he uh, He's moving and up and about. And fever is now gone. Because, you know, we just thought we'd add a little excitement to Mom and Dad's life this week. Um... What was I going to say? I was going to tell you something. What were we just talking about? Someone said something. Oh my God, online craft matchmaking. Yes, you, Case. You and you and Christine. You both have that same sense of humor. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Job. Okay. Oh, I know what I was going to say. I was going to say my supper has booze in it, too. Sean is making. It's called pasta a la vodka. It's pasta and prawns. So good. Okay, so we got that one chopped out. Can we do this? How fast can I do this? Ange, do you know when the online convention list will go out so we can order our stamp sets? So we have been told that we have to have, I have to have everything turned into Rhonda for, I think my date is August the 2nd. And then the supply list, I think it goes out the 3rd. Oh, I don't know. Um, but I can tell you right now, do I know, well, I know what mine is. Mine is, what's the leaf one called? Do you like that? The leaf one. You know the one that you can die cut and it's got the positives and the negatives of the leaves? That's the one that I had. Now, I'm trying to remember. I know she'll give you a supply list in terms of, like, colors and all that stuff. But stamp sets. What did Erica use? Erica's was adorable, and I loved it. Um can just see her layouts. I can't see the actual stamp set. Isn't that funny? I know Rhonda used that one oh, with the cool bag. You know like the, they look like bag topper dies. They're really neat. I know she used that one. I'm trying to, I'm trying to think. There was a whole bunch. Oh, no, no, no. You mean warped? I love, well, no. Yeah, yeah, kind of. But Case, isn't that why you and I get along? That's why I get along with this. Okay, so we got these. Got our little old fashions. Da -da, I did it. Okay, now the only thing we're gonna do here is, I'm gonna throw it out in the garbage and not put it on my desk, is I'm gonna grab, I did get a little splooch of black right there and I can't fix it. So it's just gonna have to stay there. Now we don't want our glasses kind of floating in la la land, cause I feel like that would imply that maybe we'd had a little bit too much to drink. So we're gonna get out, what are you? 
Slight smoky slate. That's what I wanted. <gasps> Marcy, are you doing it next month? Oh, you guys, this is, is yours forever fern. No, mine is not forever fern. It's from the new holiday stuff. So just a sec. What's mine called? I have to look at it. It's something about the leaves. It's called Love of Leaves. That's what I did. Do you like that? I'm like, Love of Leaves. I actually had a lot of fun with it. And then I'm designing one of the, the classes for the Sunday as well, which is very exciting. Okay, I'm kind of, I feel like that might be a little bit heavy. That's okay. Is that a bit heavy? Can we just flip it over? No. It is heavy though. I feel like that's a bit dark. Hmm. What if we take, here, let's just finish this. We'll do what I was doing. Mm -hmm. There we go. And then, you know, we'll try. Boop, boop. You just signed up. Yay! Oh, but Denise, was that you that came through while I was sitting here? I just saw somebody's come through while I was sitting here. But I couldn't see like that. I just saw the title of the email. Okay, so I'm using a little bit of color lifter. Boop, 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 right over top. Just watering it out a bit. How does that look? Can you see that? Yeah, it's, well, it helps. It just makes it less. Do you have a plate with a water, the color lifter? It does lift color. Okay, so we're just kind of making that a lit. I am got my stamp sets ordered on Sunday, so I'm ready to rock and roll. Cut that. Okay, so Marcy, are you one of Rhonda's downline? Are you one of Erica's downline? Who are you with? Who's your person? Or are you just a demo in the States that's not under either one of them and is just doing this because, you know, they're freaking wonderful. Okay, there we go. So we've got our little, that'll look good, working it. Okay, now this guy, he's going to go on here. We're going to send you an old-fashioned birthday. Hi, Sandy. Why is it stormy? I know, that's, Dan, Debbie, I was thinking the same thing. How did she know? I can't even remember. Um, maybe she's got Erica or Rhonda. And then maybe one of them told her. <coughs> okay, next. I'm using Love of Leaves. Yes, is that darky? I'm so excited. It actually turned out really cool. I was really kind of giddy about it. I got this stuck right here. And then my um, class, you know the extra ones? The color lifter lifts color. Yeah, I know. Shush, stop making fun of me. I'm sticking a little bit of, oops, this is a brand new seal. I had just replaced it today. And you have to do a little roll on the first one, okay? You always do. So, we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna take this, and we're gonna go, I'm under Erica. Yeah, well we, because we, well Rhonda sends out all the information to us. So we kinda, I don't, maybe it was, um, so you got information from Rhonda, maybe she's got insider information. Demo from the States, and then one of those who are orphaned. Oh good, so Mars, tell me, how did you find out which ones you need to use? Or which ones you need to order? Or did you just do like some online ordering? She's like, I just ordered them all. That's how I know. Okay, so we're going to just take this. Now, if you don't have, I didn't show very much there. Cooper! Children? Yeah. Someone needs to go check on the bad dog. Harley? Nope, not Harley. Cooper. This is the only problem with being at the lake. I love the lake. But I don't get a ton of privacy here. A little harder to do a live, so it's a good thing you guys just all bear with me. Okay, next thing we're gonna do. We have got a, I'm gonna put a white card base in this after, okay? Um, but what we're gonna start with is I have got, this is from the Beautiful World Designer Series paper. So I've got a piece of this and it's like three and seven eighths by five and an eight. Now, they didn't glue it on straight, and so guess what? I'm not gluing it on straight either. I'm getting crazy. Cooper is just exploring the bubble wrap on the floor. So in about 30 seconds when he bites it and pops it. It was in an email confirmation when you signed up. Huh. What are those dates? Look at you. Okay. So Creative Convention is a, is a, a convention for demonstrators that Rhonda Wade runs um, in the States. And I got to be part of it this year. Part of the planning, part of the designing. Super exciting. I know she is sold out of all her U.S. kits. Like there's make and take kits. 
Um, ooh, love that DSP. Oh, yes, add it to the list. Don't tell anyone. Okay, getting on my little last bits. We're going to stick this one on. Make sure you... Did, you, did I pull all those off while I was sticking them on? Huh, good thing. Weird. Didn't even notice I was doing it. Okay, this we're going to put on straight. Crooked paper, straight front. Okay, next step. This guy is going to get popped up. Do do. You should use the green side for color. Oh, no, I wasn't. I was kind of not going for the green. I More the look I was going for is just a little bit more subtle. Okay, so we're going to stick this one down here boop, 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 boop. okay and then this one we're gonna pop a little bit lower but we're gonna put it on a dimensional too the crooked DSP is ah hi Valerie okay and let's come down here let's stick you oh, make sure you're straight because you know things don't sit well in the glass when they're not straight and Let's come on. We'll stick this guy. He's gonna come for a little ride. He's he's a bit separated. Oh, I need maybe to pull you down a bit. There. And then we're gonna take that cute little. Oh, I love it, you guys. What a cute card. You can't do crooked. I know, but case, think. When you look at a card, what do you do with your head anyway? You go, oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. So it just straightens it out. So crooked, not crooked, you're good. Okay. Here we go go and we're gonna stick those on ta -ta. and then this the only problem with doing things crooked is it is really hard to stick other things on straight because it kind of warps your eye <gasps> you guys I sorry you're getting the weird sunlight it's kind of like it's glowing look at it, it's like me I'm glowing in the sun. No, I'm not. It's just really bright out and it's really stinking hot today. So I'm going to hold that one up so you can kind of get a look there. I'll come back down. That's making me want to drink and I don't drink. I know, Valerie, me and you both, doesn't it? It totally makes me want to drink, but I don't drink either. There we go. So we pulled it off. I have seven minutes to spare before I have to be on the road. Now, I definitely, for me, before I send this card, I will be going in, I'll be putting in a bit of Whisper White cardstock inside, and then maybe just, you know, like a little strip of that same DSP. So what I like to do is if you do a four by five and a quarter, and then like a one inch strip of DSP. Well, Janice, it's great. So Janice, if you're gonna case, go to page 33 of your catalog, because that's where I stole this one from, right? Anyway, sorry, those blinds are really bad. Oops, wrong way. Tip upward, does that help? There, it helps on this side maybe a bit. Yes, it does, because I have two windows right in front of me. Anyway, and now I need to get this. <laughs> I love it, Kim Peek. Anyway, this is a great one to good for your stash. I'm thinking, get, like, my dad doesn't drink, but he would he would appreciate the card. I really like it. Lemonade, we could totally do it with lemonade. Sure, that's what it was supposed to be. Anyway, you guys have an amazing evening. For those of you, um, who live in Canada, please don't forget that registration, I'm going to put the link in the comments, registration is still open. Boop, boop. I have to get to my page. Oh, or I, or I don't because it won't move. Um, registration is still open for my catalog launch event. That one is coming up at the end of, here it is, August to December mini catalog launch. Is it on Saturday, August 22nd? Is it dorky if I tell you that the cards that I designed for this might actually be my favorite cards that I have ever made, like ever made? So if you live in Canada, um, you can sign up for this event. You get a goodie bag, you get all your make and takes, you get told in advance, it tells you, you know, what stamp sets you need, whatever, um, and you have the option of adding your stamp sets on. Sorry, I'm kind of jumping all over the board right now because I'm doing two things at once. There we go, I'll put the link in the comments there. But you can check it out there. Um, and I will see you guys all tomorrow. I hope you have an amazing evening. Okay, I have to look away from you because I have to look at the computer to hit the end video button. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Take care, guys. Bye.